Pajee's been helping us a lot, along with some of the receiver coaches as far as like working some slot work and just like working on the jug machine too. So we always doing that in between periods just to make sure our hands are right and ready. <coughs> Larry Scott was here running this position. Coach, what's been the biggest adjustment you've done since an offense going through the boards that Larry's uh, Well, one thing about Coach Scott is we're definitely a more versatile offense now. I would say, and we're playing a lot faster. Coach Scott's definitely helped us with our games. But we just, with just like some one word things that we can do, and it's just, it's really helping us play a lot faster, which is one thing that we definitely love to do on offense. More versatile, how do you think? He's, he's opening up the playbook, you know, so it's just like we running the ball, passing it, getting, giving a lot of guys on the field the opportunity to make plays. Cause we got some playmakers, so he's definitely doing a good job trying to give everybody a chance. John, do you think this team's tougher this fall than it was a year ago? After this uh, the only draft? time will tell. Definitely only time will tell. But we, we coming together pretty nicely, mm -hmm. I would say. Yeah, John, your breakaway speed. I want to ask you about that, too. You had some long runs. I was watching the South Carolina game. I think you burst about, I don't know, 30, 40 yards. Oh, I ain't get away, though. Well, no, no, no. <laughs> what, do, do, you, do you feel like that's something that you, do you have that gear? Is that something that you've worked on? Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, let me get in front of you. I, I'm pretty sure I'll run away. <laughs> I'm going to run away for sure. <laughs> What's his personality like? In terms of oh, Coach Scott, he's, he's, a, he's a really good guy. A lot of us, well, everybody wants to play for Coach Scott. And he's one of those guys who's out there coaching for us. He, he really, you can tell that he takes a lot of pride in what he does and everything that he does. And he's just like a huge father, father figure to all of us. So we, and he's genuine. He's a really genuine guy, so yeah, we, we love it, Coach Scott. <laughs> John, it certainly seems like Quentin Dormady is sick of hearing about how he can't run. How much do you guys give him grief about that? Or yeah, my man can run. <laughs> <laughs> Kenny can run, man. He just when he when he decides to run, he I think he'll do a pretty good job. Of, he's a big dude, so I mean, when he takes off running, you're gonna have to go tackle him. Sure. Marquez mentioned that some of the receivers and tight ends that Jared Garantano throws the ball so hard to him over the middle and those short routes that it hurts their hand as he's trying to break their hand. <laughs> Does that happen to you guys out of the backfield as well? I mean, nah, not really. We we just got to focus on catching. That's all we got to do. I mean, however it comes, we got to make the play and catch it. If it touches our hands, we should catch it. That's what I say. That's why I tell the running backs too. So I mean, we we just trying to do a good job of catching the ball every time it comes to this. Sean, I was asked today by a former Tennessee player to describe your running style. Who I could compare you to? How would you how would you describe your running style? Uh, aggressive. <laughs> uh, I, that's pretty much how I just feel like I run. I think I just run aggressive, and it's just like my own style, really. Like I I watch a lot of guys, but I. I can just only pull so much from each person that I watch. I don't really try to copy anybody. Who, who are your favorites? Uh, some of my favorite running backs to watch. LaDainian Tomlinson. I grew up watching LaDainian Tomlinson. Uh, Devontae Freeman has been doing a really good job. I like him. Alvin. I learned a lot from Alvin as well. Uh, just like guys like uh, Chris Johnson as well. And just like a lot of other smaller backs kind of that got like the same body frame as me. I've also watched a lot of Dalvin Cook too because I like the way that Dalvin Cook ran the ball as long as well as uh, TJ Yeldon back when he was at Alabama. Some great more backs in the SEC where you rank. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, what was the question? Some great running backs in the SEC. Where do you think you rank? I think I'm the top one, definitely. I definitely think I'm the top running back in the SEC and I'm going to go out there and work, prove it every time I get a chance to Sorry, uh, you had a couple of uh, fumbles last year. How much you've been working on ball security, and what have you done for that? Oh, uh, that's definitely something that we've been working a lot. We we try to work ball security as much as we can during practice, and Coach G's been on me a lot. I've been I've been on myself harder about it too, but it's it's something that I've been working on a lot this off season. Probably the thing that I worked on the most, honestly. Right, thanks, guys. Thanks, Sean. Thanks, John. Oh, yeah, thank you. Appreciate guys. it.